We are back. Thank you so much for keeping it locked. Now, of course, JTV Hot Trends love to give you the 411 on what's happening in the BVI. And recently we had the coronation, the crowning of Miss World BVI 2016. And of course, Katia Turnbull, she's our new queen. Uh, we had the opportunity to attend the coronation ball. Now, it was a wonderful event. Miss Katia Turnbull, our new Miss BVI, World BVI 2016. Uh, she was crowned. She received her beautiful crown and she is currently away um, at the big pageant in Washington DC Miss World BVI the big pageant where she's competing against other ladies around the world and as I said it was a wonderful event we had the opportunity to speak to Miss Katia Turnbull Miss World BVI 2016 as well as Miss World BVI 2015 Sasha Wins and the mastermind behind it all Damien Grange and we want y'all to check it out right here on JTV Hot Trends Welcome back, JTV Hot Trends. We're now here with the wonderful Damien Grange. How you doing? I'm psyched. You're psyched? <laughs> yes. Why are you psyched? Because I'm excited. I think we have a wonderful representative going off, and I think she will carry the tradition that we have established the past three years mm -hmm. of young ladies representing us well. She's a good one. All right, so let's back it up a little bit. Tell us about Miss World BVI and your involvement and where it's going to be going in the future. Miss World BVI, I got involved, like I, s I mentioned earlier, it, the, from f for the philanthropic aspect. I think I'm a philanthropist uh, by heart. Mm -hmm. And I like the fact that Miss World places a great emphasis on philanthropy. In mm -hmm. fact, it's a requirement. The right. young ladies must be given back in their communities locally in order to be a representative. And so I ran with that mm -hmm. and uh, the ability to transform young women. I like that. I like to see the, the budding aspect where they grow from maybe shy and reserved yeah. into this gorgeous, eloquent, you know, queen. And so I appreciate that too. And, and I think that's how I got involved and wanted right. to take the, the, plat the program to it, it has always been a strong pr program, mm -hmm. Miss World BVI, yes. and I would like to, for us to regain yes. that glory, right. you know. Awesome stuff. Now, Miss Katia Turnbull, tell us how you, how you went about um, handpicking her. Was that a committee <sighs> effort as well? Actually, no. Katia applied to oh, be a yes. contestant. Right. And then we had some other contestants, and it, some of them were iffy, and they were like, no, we'll do it next year. Right. So we had two remaining, and then from the two, we did a, a little... Right. analysis and uh, narrowed it down and uh, Kadia was uh, of course um, fortunately we, we were able to identify a queen in Kadia yes. and I think she's going to represent us well yeah she's going to do a fantastic job awesome young lady well Mr. Grange I thank you so much of course for uh, uh, having us here tonight it was a wonderful event anybody you want to thank JTV hot trends Hello. No for respect. I, I thank you. I called you and you graciously accepted. You didn't even, if you didn't even, but you were like, I'll be there, don't worry. And I thank you so much. I think, I think when the community is aware of what we're doing and they understand it fully, then they will jump on board as well. And I, I, I think you play a big role in that. So thank you. Thank everybody for coming out, our sponsors, mm -hmm. Caribbean Insurers Limited, listen, um, that is why this scepter is the CIL scepter for 2016, mm -hmm. and so she will be protecting us on, on the, yeah, with her scepter. Okay. And uh, all our sponsors, Omi, Jazani, um, 
Yumi Katsura. Mm. Yes, I was looking at those gowns. They are amazing. And here it is that she'll be wearing gowns that is valued at thousands of dollars. Awesome. Simply because Yumi Katsura decided that, you know what, we want to give back to the BVI. Right. And, and, and I must also big up Terry Donovan because mm. he was very much instrumental in making that happen. Okay. So I'm grateful. Yumi Katsura showed at Summer Sizzle. Summer Sizzle. Yes. Yeah, Beautiful and gowns. he made it happen, and I'm so grateful for that. So. Uh, Kadia will be wearing expensive frock, my love. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. So all, right. all our sponsors, uh, the Premier, the Ministry of Education, they have been there. Um, Hazim, Jazani, Umi. Uh, I, I may become redundant just trying to remember everybody, but I'm so appreciative. And all those who are supporters of the Miss World platform, thank you guys so much. We could not have done it without you. And now we look forward for us now here to support Kadia while she's in DC representing us log on vote Support. it's part of it mm -hmm. you know so thank you JTV no respect thank you so much JTV Hot Trends, it's your girl, the one and only Sophie B. And tonight we are here at the crowning of Miss World BVI 2016-2017. But I'm standing next to Miss World BVI 2015-2016, Miss Sasha Wintz. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Very good. So now tonight you give you gave up your crown, but let's talk about your reign. Let's talk about some of the things that you did within your reign. Well, first of all, my beauty with a purpose was to help with the autism mm -hmm. and also help the differently abled. As my cousin, he is diagnosed with Down syndrome, mm -hmm. so that also helped me, and that also uh, that also uh, that sorry that also put my mind mm -hmm. to focusing on the different differently disabled. Right. So I was already set. I was like, they were like, what are you gonna do for a beauty with a purpose? I was like. Autism. autism there so what are some of the things that you did to actually shed light on autism well I went to the Esden Henley school mm -hmm. I gave them little trinkets and also gave them cute toys and books to read also because education is the key yes so yeah and this was your first time actually partaking in a pageant um, are we gonna see miss wins probably for miss BVI what are, what are some of the things you're hoping to do I'm thinking about it not right now but I'm thinking about it. Yes. Well, I think you'll be a fantastic candidate. Thank you so much. <laughs> all right. Anybody you want to shout out, say thank you to? Shout out to all the supporters and all my family and friends that helped me. It was a blessing to be an ambassador for the British Virgin Islands. And I would do it again, but I'm taking a break right <laughs> now. I'm taking a break right now. But it was, it was phenomenal. It was amazing. Traveling to China, learning different cultures. I loved it. And lastly, what are some encouraging words that you would leave for uh, Miss World BBI 2016 2017, Miss Kadia Turnbull? Well, Kadia, well, me and Kadia go way back, yeah. cheerleading days, <laughs> but Kadia always stay focused, never, never doubt yourself, always believe in yourself, stay confident. You're beautiful, you have the look, you can do the runway, and always put God first. And whenever you feel like giving up, just always remember the reason why you started. All right, good stuff. Well, thank you so much, Sasha. And I hope to see you in the future on the runway, on the stage, yes. doing your thing. Yes, yes, I will. JTV Hot Trends, we are here, ladies and gentlemen, at the crowning of Miss World BVI 2016-2017. And I'm standing here with... The newly crowned Miss BVI, World BVI, Katie Turnbull. How you doing? I am excited. You're excited. Congratulations, first of all. Now, of course, tonight is your night. You were introduced to the BVI. Go ahead and tell the people a little bit about how you got involved with the uh, Miss World BVI pageant. Well, there was an ad, and I responded. And then I thought about what this pageant means to the BVI and what it means to be a part of it. I noticed that every queen in the past stayed true to their platform and I was too working on a depression support alliance in the BVI and I thought that if I auditioned for this pageant that it would provide a good um, conduit for yes. the depression alliance support team that I'm trying to accomplish here in the BVI. Right. So your platform is depression and being Miss World BVI you're hoping to shed a little bit more light on depression so are you working with like mental health what are some of the things that you're doing to shed light on depression? 
Right now I'm liaising with an international company called DBSA, which is Depression Bipolar Support Alliance. Um, I'm liaising with the Florida chapter at this time so that we can hopefully open a chapter right here in the BVA. Nice, good stuff. Now, what are some of the things that are lined up for you um, as Miss World BVI? Well, tomorrow, as you know, I'm going off to Washington, D.C. Hey. Yes, where I'll be competing amongst 100 beautiful women from across the world. Wow, and what are some of the categories that you're going to be uh, participating in? Top model segment, which I hope to excel well, you in. got that. Hello. <laughs> there's evening wear, there's talent, and there's even a sports section. Right. There's also no swimsuit segment in this competition. Really? And you have such a lovely body. Now, you're not a stranger. We all know you've, uh, you've modeled for Summer Sizzle. You've done a lot of stuff. Um, tell us a little bit about that part of, of your life in terms of modeling. Well, modeling started off fresh out of high school back in 2008, mm -hmm. and from there it just skyrocketed after I met Terry Donovan when he was doing his second year with um, BVI Summer Sizzle. Yeah. And I just kept doing it because I'm naturally small, so I maintained my <laughs> figure. <laughs> yes. And I have the height. Yes. Almost. And um, I just continue strutting my stuff on a runway. Right. But it doesn't stop there. I try to encourage other up and coming models to do the same, but as well as spreading out a positive message that. The runway isn't just about strutting, it's about being confident, being one with yourself, being sure of yourself with your body and your mind. All right, good stuff. Well, before we go, somebody might be looking, watching, and they're suffering from depression. What would you like to tell that person? Don't give up. Don't. Don't give up. There's always someone there that you could call on. You could even call on your mom, your dad, your teacher, anyone. Don't give up, period. Right. And I heard you mention earlier your Facebook page. Tell us a little bit about your Facebook page and how we could follow you. Well, um, it's Kadia Cares at Facebook, and you could follow it. I post daily inspirational insights and tips mm -hmm. as to how to battle depression, how to give support to people that you know suffering from it or have signs of it, yeah. how to change the look on it to something different because people think it's all about something dreary, but yeah. it could be turned into something very pow powerful and fulfilling. All right, good stuff. So proud of you, Miss Turnbull. I wish you lots of luck. You leave tomorrow. Safe travels and, you know, knock them dead. Thank you, Sophie. All right, ladies and gentlemen, our new Miss World BVI 2016, Miss Kadia Turnbull, of course, shedding light on depression. She's got a Facebook page as well. If you might need some information, if you're suffering from depression, it's called Kadia's Depression Insight Alliance. Go to Facebook and like that page. And of course, seek the help or get the help that you may need if you're suffering from depression. All right. More of JTV Hot Trends is to come, ladies and gentlemen. Please keep it locked.